A tragedy on the water this holiday weekend is to blame for the death of a young man who went underwater and never resurfaced. His body was recovered by a dive team on Belleville Lake, marking the third drowning in Metro Detroit in as many days. 7 News Detroit reporter Brett Cast is in Van Buren Township tonight with how a day of fun took such a heartbreaking turn. Well, late this evening, you can still see the smoke smoldering from the bonfire on that island. It's our understanding the men were at that island parked there when they walked on the sandbar, and that's when the current became too much. A Memorial Day on Belleville Lake ending in tragedy. Police telling us that after a more than three hour search, divers recovered the body of a 23 year old man in 11 feet of water. He had disappeared while waiting on a sandbar near Firecracker Island with three other family members. One family member tried to save him as he was going underwater. They're leaving with a less person and that's awful. It's just horrible. Kat McQuaid parks her pontoon at the island often. As you walk the sandbar and uh, you may be at two feet and then you can go boom, 15 feet, 20 feet, 30 feet. Family identified the victim as Patrick Todd. His sister Mindy provided this photo and says he was adopted by her parents after being born with fetal alcohol syndrome, describing him as kind and loving with a laugh like SpongeBob. This is just horrible. Patrick's death is the third drowning in Metro Detroit this Memorial Day weekend. The first happened at Holly Recreation Area Saturday afternoon, followed by another drowning Saturday at Galloway Lake in Auburn Hills. You're in the no wake zone, Skipper. Vital speed. Today, we went on the water with Macomb County Sheriff's Office for tips on water safety. One way uh, that people can uh, almost guarantee that they will not drown is if they're wearing a personal flotation device. Their tips include to never swim alone, have a life jacket that fits, have a sober driver, have a way to communicate with people on shore, and have proper understanding as well as respect for water depths and currents. It's bad and that undertow is just ridiculous. And again, this is at least the third drowning death just this Memorial Day weekend here in Metro Detroit. The police across the state urging caution around the water this summer. In Van Buren Township, I'm Brett Cast, 7 News, Detroit. Far too many